So hey guys, how's it going on? I hope you're doing well. It's your buddy ASG here and today we're gonna explore top 10 best completed Pokemon GBA ROM hacks that were trending on an average scale on our channel. So it took me two days to make the video as the game choices are very hard and minor warning at the starting, some games might have bugs who are still in the development process, okay? The list of the games I've chosen consists at least one or two of the features like games depending on storyline, games depending on the engine function, core functions depending on the difficulty or depending on the QL improvements okay so without wasting any time let's go for the showcase and explore the wonders First of all, we have Pokemon Ruby Renip by developer Athecane Core. Although this developer was very much nice to cooperate about the updates or bug fixes issues related to the game, some of the major features you're gonna like. Mega Evolution as a proper battle gimmick, Pokemons from generation 1 to 9. There are two regions and one island to explore in this game which makes it more cool. Increased EXP level range for more difficulty or higher training. I'd recommend this game for the beginner players too, okay? On the list, next one is Pokemon Fire Red and Leaf Green Plus plus edition by developer Dio Kishisu. This developer had worked a lot for managing the decompiled Pokemon Fire Red. Some of the major aspects about the game you're gonna like. Much more challenging difficulty modes like Black and White 2. You're just gonna change the game mode from Fire Red to Leaf Green or do the opposite. The post game system was also expanded so you can visit all of these special islands including you can get every ticket for the every Pokemon event. EXP multiplier and the perfection for EVs and IVs was also good for this game. I would recommend this game for an average player who is familiar familiar with Nuzlocke concepts or harder difficulty concepts too, okay? On the list, next one is Pokemon Unknown by developer Brace Guardian. This game is a perfect choice if you're searching for an easy version of Pokemon Radical Red, sort of similar to Inflamed Red but some key features you're gonna love is the built-in challenge or Nuzlocke system. You can get Jesse and James as your Pokemon rival or the second rival. Automated healing and minimal grinding mode saves your time on training as well. The achievement system makes your adventures more cool and more effective on your way. I'd I recommend this game for the beginner players and the average players as well. On the list, next one is Pokemon Mercury as a project by developer Beery. Excellent masterpiece version of Johto where it has similar teeth with the Pokemon Geos Chronicles. The main key difference where the CFR engine implies this, okay? Enhanced its more features. Some of the major features were the adaptation of following Pokemon with shadows, higher possibility of Pokemon up to generation 8 including the Hisuian ones, the graphical improvements, Dexnav and UI upgrades made it more attractive, the semi-incitation of power gimmicks like Dynamax, Megas, Z Crystals, etc. I was kinda confused on the recommendation for this game as it is in Chinese, but the average player who understands the Jota very well, they should give it a try if you're gonna spam the A button only in case, okay? On the list, next one is Pokemon Emerald Crest by developer Agath. He had to very much care about the updates with each effect and each announcement. This is an exceptional version of Hoenn where the more decompiled functions get more priority and Keyhole upgrades made it more majestic with each update. Some major features about the game you're gonna like. Increased deck snap probability for more rare encounters. All Pokemons from generation 1 to 9 can be included as per your need or command. Expansion of new items and dynamic level scaling with EXP share all for your Pokemon party. Various difficulty modes like randomizer, nuzlocke, mirror, chaos mod, etc. Now this one is recommended for both pro and average players who like to set up their own difficulty range in a custom way, okay? On the list, next one is Pokemon Rocket Edition by developer Dragon's Den. An exceptional version of Pokemon where you become the opposite of a hero character. You're gonna rank up to a higher position in Team Rocket. So what are the major features about this game? You're gonna carry on major missions and become the Rocket Head of Team Rocket. All Pokemon from Generation 1 to 9 and custom Megas including some fake mons and chance to explore Kanto, Johto, Hoenn, Sevi Islands and even Sinnoh, okay? In the latest update. Discover the dark storyline of the main game or main Plot. Now this one is also recommended for both beginner and average player who likes to follow a storyline concepts like me. On the list, next one is Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu GBA by developer Kevin Pokepan. An awesome GBA ROM pack with the revised Kanto and classical experience with modern timeline including the graphical changes. So what are the major features for this game? The overall encounter was a revolutionary feature that made this game much popular. You can just obtain all of the generation 1 to 9 Pokemon as per the version 
immersion exclusives. There are items across all generations to help your Pokemon with growth. Just take out Pikachu to another new adventure on the Kanto. Now this one is recommended for every type of player or each category depends on the classical experience. On the list, next one is Pokemon Exceeded by developer Benny Boy. This game is similar with Pokemon Emerald Crest, but in this one you can check the core functions and change it as you like. Some of the key features of the game are, you can obtain every Pokemon from generation 1 to 9 including some of the generation 9 DLC upgrades. You get some stat and damage formulas similar to Pokemon Arceus Legends. It offers Dexnav, EXP share all, 4 difficulty modes and more side quests. So I would recommend this game surely for a beginner and average player because they can unlock everything as per their need. On the list, next one is Pokemon Ultra Shiny Gold Sigma by developer Aeolia Leo. So we picked another Johto regional detective game that got much popularity in last two years. So what are the best key features about the game? Improved graphics, mega evolution in battle, gym leader of rematches, explore the regions of Johto, Kanto, Orange Island and Hoenn, experience the DNS system on live mode, dawn, day, afternoon, dusk and night mode, new items such as the shiny charm, joy checker and skill capsule to help you on your journey. Majority of Pokemon were included from generation 1 to 7 but there are Hisuian, Galarian and Alolan forms as well. Some paradox Pokemon like Great Tusk, Fluttermane, Sandy Shocks, Roaring Moon, Iron Valiant and Iron Thorns are available. Other Pokemon such as Ursaluna, Fairy Giraffe, Regilecki were also added to the game. Lastly, this game has a good collection of evolutions for more Pokemon types. As of now, I'd like to recommend this game to everyone who wants to explore more regions. On the list, the final one is Pokemon Nameless by developer 118. Finally, we're going to talk about another storyline based game with a major plotline. So what are the main or key features about the game? HM moves are replaced with skills or various skills on the game. Journey to explore the regions of Western Tyrone, Saiyan, Sevi Islands and Landay. Participate in the arenas instead of gym battles because there are no gym battles in the game. Only the selected Pokemons from generation 4 to generation 9. You're gonna get the self-thinking system for your playable character which will guide you throughout the journey. I'd like to recommend this game to the average player who wants to explore more storyline depictive games, okay? We're almost at the end of the video. Thanks for watching the full video. You can rate the games via commenting or giving the feedback depending on your experience after playing it. As usual, if you need top 5 or top 10 showcases, just ask about it or in case you want me to showcase some other games that you made or any other developer made, you can ask about it too. Okay, now you may check our website a-start-gaming for further info or details, check the description for our sources, also leave a like if this video was helpful indeed.